What up guys, today I'm playing some more Battlefield 3 and um, on this one I'm going to be, uh, I will be in a tank so but I'm going to be running around as well and I'm going to try to give you some helpful tips when doing so. Now I'm going to start off in the middle of the game because um, this was a long game so I had to edit some of these things out. And I'll tell you at the beginning of this game I was in a tank I was trying to get C because I understand when uh, when you play on this map and you start on this t uh, the US side most people are gonna go to A and another uh, then the other half is gonna go to B right away so again think of, thinking ahead I tried to go to C right away but uh, I got two tanks at me and I just I couldn't you know hold them off or I just died right away so um, at this point uh, where I started at I spawned his, on this guy and he was just I don't know just laying there I don't know what the fuck he was doing but I had to run up here and now I'm just trying to make my way over to C just to try to take it over so right here I got a jeep just driving around I get him. Now I could have got in the jeep, but I decided just to keep running on foot. So over here, I also saw another guy that there he is, way over here too. So I started shooting him, but I didn't get him that time. Right, now I get around that rock. Most of the time, though, when you're playing on this board, you won't see guys over here. You're gonna see them more on the right side going to A um, you know or you know near C or B you're not really gonna see them this far off on the left really unless they're sniping or something so right now I'm just making my way over to C because I want to take that over because I think at this point we're losing right now I'm not really sure. but uh Again, I just want to take C over, so hopefully we can, you know, get all all these things cap captured. Like right off in the distance, I can see we're getting D. So I feel pretty confident that C is going to be pretty clear to, to actually grab. And where to get, when you're getting C, you can actually get C from like right here around this corner. It's a good place to be if you're on the U.S. side. Um, you can actually see where the terrorists are coming from. If, they're coming over to see right here I like to move up here too because right up here you can actually see more of the uh, map and uh, it's a good spot to be but at the same time you gotta make sure you pay attention to those stairs to the left or just your mini map um, just to make sure no one's gonna come up behind you and like uh, kill you that way so right here I see A's got taken over But I see, uh, again, I just keep looking around until I get C, what you get. And then I see that B's going to get taken over, so I start heading back over there. And again, when you're going over the B, guys, uh, the places you want to look are like in the buildings, like the two buildings right in front of me. They're either going to be in there, or they're going to be like in the building sure in front of me, or around it. So that's pretty much where you want to look when you're trying to run over here. Right there, I threw a grenade over there because a lot of people like to camp in that corner of that building. So I just threw one over there just to see if there's a guy over there or not. There wasn't. So now I'm just trying to grab B and I'm just looking uh, in this direction because again, I'm on the. Uh, on the US side, I think. Or is this the Russian side? I don't know. I'm on this side that when you start off, you get A right away. So I always look towards D, expecting guys you know, coming, to come that way. So we get B, so uh, again, when you're playing like 
conquest is mostly what you're gonna do be doing on foot. Uh, you're probably gonna be running one from one point to another. Right there, I see a tank. I get a lucky shot on it that you know it's just about to blow up. So uh, I got the last rocket into it to actually blow it up. Again, I head back over the sea. Take it over. Again, I go up to my spot again. I like staying up here. But again, guys, you always gotta look towards the look on your mini map and look at that scare staircase every now and then just to make sure no one's coming up behind you. Right there, uh, I just get shot at from behind. Again, he came up those staircases. But right here, he's dumb. We have C. So what I'm going to do, I see where he went, so I'm just going to spawn on C, and this spawns me right where he is, and I, I, know, I already know where he is, so I just get him right back. So right here, I'm just going to speed things up here, guys. Um, that might be a shitty edit, but whatever. Right here, I get the tank again. So right now I can see they're taking over C again. So I'll, I start heading in that direction. Right there, I I already know there's like again I edited some of this out, but there's two tanks at C, so I just started shooting at C. To hopefully. Uh, See if I'm gonna hit one at least. Right there, there's a jeep running by. Uh, I try to shoot at it. It keeps driving right towards me, so I'm able to get him. So now I'm moving up the sea, kind of slow. This tank kind of just stops right there. I'm trying to get by, but I just end up hitting. Again, when you're trying to get sea and you're looking at a tank, you want to look in that building that I always say go into. Just you know, put a round in there. Or just make sure there's nothing in there before we actually try to get uh, sea. So right now I'm just going to around. Uh, just making sure I look around before I actually go in here. Again, you probably don't want to stay on this side, especially if you're by yourself. You probably want to be on like near that building that I was at, grabbing it. Like you can hide behind that corner. But I decided to move up here, and I see that tank right there, and he's too busy shooting at the other tank, so I'm able to just to uh, to actually blow him. But again, I get out, try to fix him, but I think there's a guy behind us, uh, behind me, shooting rockets at me. So right here, I'm just trying to wait to see if he, if he actually gonna come out or not. Throw a grenade over there again. I see that rocket. Then I run over here and he's not there, so I'm guessing he went back around. So I start going this way. Again, I see him right there. I take a little pop shots at him. I didn't get him, but right there I get him. And again, guys, once you run out of ammo and you're shooting at somebody, you might as well just switch over to your uh, handgun and try to get them that way. You're just you're not going to be able to get them by reloading. It's a lot faster and a lot quicker too. Like most people just try to reload. Um, so it's a lot better if you just switch over to your handgun and try to get them that way. So right here I see they're going to be, I'm just going to head back over there and try to get that taken back over. I could have gone a D um, where I was before. I could have done that but I just decided to get B.
And I also see they got A, so I'm just going to make my way back to A as well. And again, when you're going to A and you're coming from B, you usually want to stay to the far left. Uh, going If you're going from B to A, stay to the far left. Uh, you usually catch guys coming up that way from A. But right here, I'm kind of going like down the middle, so... Right there, I see a guy. I get him. And again, usually people don't really stay at the points once they grab them. They, you know, grab them, just run off. But right here is a good place to be if you're grabbing A. Um, you know, you're not in the building, but you know, you're just around it. So you can pretty much see what's going on. So I get A, and then they again, they just take B right over. So I start heading back to B. Again, this is usually where you're going to find people coming from B too, if you say to the far right, if you're coming from A to B. So, um, you know, just expect this like, run into somebody. Uh, if you're coming this way. Right here I see a boat coming down. I figure he's trying to go to A. So my focus on him. I didn't get him there so I just decided to pull my rocket out to try to shoot him. Shoot at him that way. Then I just get shot from behind. So again I speed things up. Again here guys. Grab A. I just start again trying to make my way back to B from this uh from the far right side. I just like staying on the far right side because again people coming from B will usually come this way so I can easily get them when I go this way. So right there I see a guy down there trying to shoot a rocket at him, but it you know, doesn't get him. So again, I just try to take my time to see where he went to another guy down there. Shoot another rocket at him, but again, I don't get him. Again, right here, I'm trying to shoot him, but I just keep fucking hitting his ass. Someone else gets him. Up. So now I'll just make my way over to B. Grab B. Notice that this building's taken down, but again, you know, stay around this corner. You should be fine. Again, once we get B, I start making my way over to C. Again, you never want to run around too much. You don't want to go, you know, run straight to B to C. You always want to stop and look around and just see what's going on. Again, right here, make sure that building's clear before I jump in there. And then I just run to my usual spot. Right there I get that guy, I'm lucky enough to see he ran over there. Then I jump down just because I saw that smoke around or whatever that was. So I just figure someone actually saw where I was. Alright, here we get C. We're trying to get C. So I haven't got it yet. Again, I go back up here because I see a tank. So I reload my rocket, I shoot my rocket at it. No, I hit it that time. I didn't get him that time though, I missed him with my rocket. But uh, again, that's pretty much it for the end of this video guys, so thanks for watching. And as you saw right there, I got knifed, because I wasn't paying attention. But again, thanks for watching, and I hope you liked it.